Kofi Osho Master Lee. And Lulu. All right, we got here two different audio headsets that we bought because we're YouTubers and podcasters <laughs> and we need good headphones in order to be able to hear ourselves talk and listen to the music. These particular ones here are about the same price. Honestly, I can't really tell the difference between the two. So we're gonna review both of them for you today, share with you what we think of some of the differences. But you know, straight up, they're very, very similar, but they're two completely different models. Ah, uh, same brand. Same brand. Different models. Different models. Ah. Uh. Slightly different design, but the sound quality for both, that's what we're going to share with you. Okay. Now, the best thing about these headphones, straight up, is that they're very affordable. I mean, if you're looking for very high quality headphones for under 50 bucks, these are it. And I'm not just talking high quality in terms of the sound, but also the construction, it's pretty, really well designed for under $50. And because we use these for both podcasts and music, for me, like the music quality has to be good when you listen to these babies. Mm-hmm, that's right. And I can tell you, the upgrade we went from, right, which is from Apple iPods to this, so noticeable, worth Big it. Big difference. Huge <laughs> difference. Just because the sound is so much more full, Yes. And it's also very distinctly clear. It's just crystal clear, pristine, like a thing. <laughs> you can hear it. And you can hear the rumbles down low, like things that right. normally I just, you know, you get so used to wearing headphones mm -hmm. that sometimes you kind of lose out and miss out on the range of sound that you hear from, like music. Yeah. And with this one, you can appreciate more the vocals. Right? When you oh, react to... The voice is so clear. <laughs> it's really yeah. good. And our fans loved it now that we are wearing these. Yeah, our fans <laughs> love that the fact that we're listening to music and our reaction videos with, you know, something that feels like it's better quality, get the full experience. Mm -hmm. Now, the big difference here, right? If you were to say that is the biggest difference is, uh, what is a DJ headset, all right? The other one is a studio headset. The difference, the DJ headsets are round. So they're designed to cup your whole ear so that, you know, if you're at a live venue and it's super loud, I guess there's less sound leakage. So that's that's one plus. But the other thing is that, like a lot of DJs do, they want to look cool. They're going to flip like one of these headphones the other way around and then they're going to hold it up to the <laughs> ear. They're like, oh yeah, that's my music that I'm playing. Mm, I'm getting a turn on listening to really? my own music. Ah. The other ones don't flip around like that. So do you care about that? If you do and you're a DJ, I guess get the DJ one. But otherwise, honestly, if it's the same price, why even design a headphone that doesn't do that? It doesn't really make a difference either way. Like the construction's solid like, all the way around. Interesting. Now the other one has more of an oval shape for the ear padding. This is the one you now typically wear. You say you like this one better. Yes, especially because I wear accessories. So this shape is Perfect, especially if I'm wearing big earrings and it covers completely and it doesn't really bother me. It doesn't hurt. So. Yeah, but wouldn't these, which are a lot bigger, no, sit around the outside doesn't. better? It doesn't because of my earrings. That's one reason to get the other headset. Uh-huh. You know, let's do a real test. Let's do a test here. You want to watch John Wick? Or let's or... watch John Wick. You ain't real, hope the All right, switch. Holy cow. It's loud. That's, That's the loud. Like, best thing about volume? these. The volume on these. You're screaming. Are freaking <laughs> amazing. Oh, man, I'm turning off with John Wick. I'm telling you. Yeah. The trailer really gets your what adrenaline pumping. All right, we got to switch off quick. Got to switch off quick. All right, I'm a cowboy. All right, I do hear a difference. I like this better. <laughs> you do i like these better then you know when it's too loud this kind of hurt my ears so the high notes the high notes so that's yeah. what i noticed this one is more gentle you know what i think it is the dj ones there's a bit of a dial up in certain tones one is the bass on this one i've noticed is is more powerful like i actually does, feel though. rumble more of it yeah. and i don't know if it's because it's rounder or if it was designed that way because djs need to feel their bass you know what i'm saying like oh, go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> and some of the highs maybe the tweaks around that are made a little more emphasis on the treble so mm. maybe it's a little bit sharper uh so it is tweaked maybe like a, it's dialed up it's boosted if you will for both the treble 
and the bass. But otherwise, they're very No, comparable. they're really good, yeah. Like, if you were to just give one and switch it off to someone else, I don't think most people know unless you're doing something like this as a side-by-side. -side. You're not going to hate it either way because I wouldn't say that the bass here is so overwhelming. That you're no, like, it's oh, not. Like, it's ruining everything. Yeah. But I did notice because, you know, it's a Kanye song with opera, so the opera on the high end. Na, 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 boom. You know, yeah, like the mix was just spot on. The construction for these overall are really good as well. For 50 bucks, you're not expecting everything to be metal. There's a lot of plastic in it, but it's it's really solid construction, and that's really important one. Number two, you know, this fake leather, and I'm almost certain it's fake. You can't smell it. It's like pleather, I'm sure. Um, right now, it looks great. I'm almost certain, Ludette, especially now that I know what happens with your headsets because I bought you the Beats one, this will start to rub out, and it will start to, like, peel and especially if you get sweaty ears, like if you wore this to a workout, which I don't advise, um, this will start to peel as well. That's the problem with this kind of stuff like the fake leather. But brand new, you're not going to notice a difference. Right. The other part, too, was I was really concerned about because, you know, when we're on here talking to you like this, is that there might be sound leakage. So my fear is that you're going to hear what ends up happening inside the headphones. And I did a test on this, and I have to say, the padding is freaking good if you were just to leave it open like this it's loud you can it's hear loud. it but the minute you actually have it on your ears i've noticed like you cannot hear anything that's leaked out on these mics it doesn't feel like it's too tight on the head and it doesn't feel like it has to be clamped so much that you can't like your ears get sweaty or your ears start to hurt and that's always been a problem for me because i have gigantic like dumbo ears your ears line. not that big i have a problem with headsets i would say every headset that i owned have always started to hurt my ear after about i believe you because hour. you have tons of headsets in this house and that's a problem because <laughs> i buy them and you can't test headphones for an hour in a store they're not going to let you do that so i buy them and in an hour so you could just feel like the pain these i've had not had a problem with kudos would i recommend one over the other I mean, I guess I do like the DJ ones better. You like the studio ones better. <laughs> Both, however, are rock solid. Pretty good. Ooh, oh, there is one more really great feature about what, this thing. What? 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 You have double wires hooked in, right? So one can be hooked into a computer. Another one can be hooked into, like, podcast equipment or if you're playing with a musical instrument. However, you can connect two together because of this design. So we can listen to the same music at the same time, and they can be tethered. That's a really That's cool design cool. that I have not seen in any other headsets. It's kind of a very specific use case, but I would say that, you know, if you got two kids in the back seat and they want to watch a movie, rather than buy a splitter, you just have these two headphones tethered together, hooked up to like a VCR. What did I just say VCR? How old are my kids? <laughs> How old is my car? Boom. It, it works so well. And for what we do here, like for a podcast, listen to music, it's perfect. It works perfectly. So for the price, it's you not cannot bad. go wrong. They honestly sound like plus $100 headsets. Hey, and if you want to buy them, we got a link below. In fact, if you want to buy anything, buy something really expensive using our Amazon link. Like buy a refrigerator because we get a cut <laughs> of that. Buy a car. So help us out. Amazon. Oh, that's how it works. You use our Amazon link. There's a Have car in the Amazon. <laughs> Probably toy car.